James says to us in James 2 and 26, the very moment you separate body and spirit, you end up with a corpse. Separate faith and works, and you get the same thing, a corpse. James tells us that words without works are worthless. A mere profession of faith is useless without that faith being put into practice. James' primary point is consistency, that there must be an equivalence between what we say and what we do. To fail to exercise consistency is to bring into question the authenticity of our profession. Ray Steadman, in his book, Authentic Christianity, states it this way, the authentic Christian life is essentially and radically different from the natural life lived by a man or woman. Outwardly, it can be very much the same, but inwardly, the basis of living is dramatically different. Christ is a part of every wholesome action the corrector of every wrong deed or thought, the giver of joy and the healer of hurt. No longer merely on the edges of life, Christ is the center of everything. Life revolves around him. As a consequence, life comes into proper focus. Despite outward trials, a deep peace possesses the heart, strengthens its grip on the spirit, and joy radiates out. This is real living. Are we consistent? Pray with me, please. Lord, as we go today, motivate us and our faith that we might move in faithful service. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Sunday is the fifth of this month, a bonus Sunday of sorts for most Baptists. Make the most of the bonus.